everyone. So today we'll be importing a SAS file into Python. I've, in this variable file location, I've just saved where I've got my file. And so to read it in, all we need to do is import pandas. File import pandas. Uh, then what we're going to do is we're going to read in the file into a data frame. So we need to give it a name. So usually just go df, and that is equal to pd, so pandas, dot read underscore sass, and then we put where our file is. So you can put a long string of where it is, but since we've got it saved in file location, we can just put file location. And that'll import it, and we'll just do df.head, just to inspect it, see if it's all gone well. So we run, sorry, should run file location to save that, and then run the import. And there we go, we can see that the file has been imported. I don't know what this file or data set is, uh, something about pizza and college income, anyway. So it's imported successfully. So that's it, that's all you really need to know. One extra thing I will just show you is sometimes you can get this UTF-8 encoding error. Um, I've, I've had it come up before when at work when reading in other people's files. One way you can overcome that is still do the same thing, df dot oh if I can copy and paste properly so the same thing just read SAS file location but if you are only forgetting this UTF-8 error then you just add after it encoding equals Latin dash one I think it's a few different encodings you can try but usually that's the one that will fix it so um, yeah basically if you get that error just chuck that into your um, read SAS function. But otherwise, that's everything. If you've got any questions or comments, please let me know. And if you've got any ideas or requests for future videos, please um, leave a comment and yeah, I'll see what I can do. Thanks.